group of high school students with special needs hit the golf course today, but not for what you might think. And these students, they didn't go to play golf, but instead to have a cooking lesson. News 15's Kenny Dar has more. Chefs on the Green is a program that combines the joys of eating delicious food while learning valuable safety tips for when you're in the kitchen. It's a program we created, you know, just wanted to bring something fun and exciting for the kids. Head golf pro Chris Arsenault says he got the idea for Chefs on the Green while living in New York. You know, when they say the word golf, I don't play golf, but everybody loves to eat. So if I can combine the two arts, you know, just like taking a blank canvas and making that picture, you know, come to life. Chefs on the Green is a small portion of a larger program that allows high school students with special needs experience potential career paths while working towards walking across the stage. You can't do it as fast as I do it, but I can teach you how to do it, just like this. So they're actually earning credits towards graduation. On Mondays, Chris has little assignments we come and do, and it gives the kids a sense of working and a vocation that they might be interested in. Public Information Officer for the Lafayette Parish School System, Allison Dickerson, says programs like these also give students a head start with learning valuable real-world skills. And they get to experience what it's like to be on an actual work site and actually learn the skills that they need to be out in the community and have a job whenever they finish their high school education. As for the students who were understandably camera shy, well, it's safe to say they had fun being outside of the classroom, even if only for a little while. What was your favorite part about today? Yeah. Seeing the chef cook. The fish. Huh? Do you prefer cooking food or you prefer to just have it made already and you just get to dig in? Yeah. <laughs> Reporting in Lafayette, Kenny Dar, News 15.